Setting up for a wedding is a regular ritual for staff at the Ramada Park Hall Hotel, but this week it feels very different. The order to fix the hotel's water management system has meant big changes. As well as the ban on overnight guests, the toilets have been closed until remedial work is carried out. Portaloos have been brought in to replace them. Friday we had over 5,000 gallons of water brought into the hotel. We've spent time around the clock individually booking out all of our residential guests and all of the weddings Friday, Saturday, Sunday and today are all going ahead as planned. Legionella bacteria were discovered in samples taken from the hotel's water system, although there's no evidence of anyone contracting Legionnaire's disease as a result. The council says it had to put the health of residents and those visiting the city first. It says it will work with the hotel to make sure all the necessary improvements are made so that there is no risk to public health. There have been some complaints online and the consequences can be ruinous. Last week, the Feathers Hotel in Ludlow shut down. Last year, a guest died there after contracting legionnaires from the hotel's plumbing. Edwin Ladd runs business networking events at the Wolverhampton Hotel. The next one is due in a fortnight, so he met the manager today to learn what the effect will be. Um, I, was, I was shocked to hear about it when I first heard about it, but I know now that they're doing everything that they can to get it fixed and sorted and back and running. The hotel say more than a thousand people are still attending functions here every weekend. The owners are hoping the 74 bedrooms will be taking guests again in the next few weeks. Audrey Diaz, BBC Midlands Today, Wolverhampton.